Hello, this is Christy. In this short tutorial in Zara Designer Pro X, I will show you how you can export a image with a transparent background from Zara Designer Pro. That is useful if you want to create an illustration or a graphic in Zara and then import it somewhere else and use it on a different background. Or if you want to use it on the web and you have to change the background and just put the image in there and you can see through the background. So this is very easy to achieve in Zara. So Zara can export images in JPEG, PNG, GIF, and many other formats. And you want to export as PNG. And I'm going to show you how you need to select the options to export with transparency. So let's get started. I'm going to just draw a simple shape in here. I'm just going to draw a heart uh, really quick. Nothing fancy, just for demonstration purposes. So let me just zoom in and close this here. Okay, so this is just, you know, creating a, a little heart here. Uh, I'm not really trying too hard. Uh, okay, so here we go. So let's make this red and a bit of a outline there. So this is my shape. And if you move it off the page, you can see there is no background or nothing. It's just a simple shape um, that I created here. So. How do I export this with transparency? So you need to go to the file menu and you have some quick options here like export JPEG, PNG, PDF. Um, and this is not, um, you know, it's not random fact that they are, these three are here because JPEGs are, you know, very low um, size, you know, small size, compressed, but they don't support transparency. PNG, they support transparency and PDFs are obviously, you can export the entire page as a PDF to send to someone. So what I'm gonna choose is actually export, just the option export here. You can press Shift Control E to export. I'm just gonna click this and then you need to choose where to save your picture. In the save dialog box, in the export dialog box, you need to choose a location and then if you look down here, save as type, just change to PNG. We're not done yet. Let's just give it a, a file name. So let's call it transparent heart. Okay. And when you press export, you're not done yet because you get this window with the options to export. And if you don't have this selected here, this is the main thing. If you have this by set to true color, you will see there is white around your shape. You can also uh, zoom in and out here to fit, to see the, the entire shape. So if you look here, there is still white around it. So make sure that in the color depth drop down, you don't leave it to true color, but true color plus alpha. This is what transparency means, alpha channel. This is exported with your image. And look what happens when I choose this, the background around my image is transparent. So now I can export it. Of course, before you do that, just make sure you go to the bitmap size tab and choose the exact size you want your picture to be. So let's call it 500 pixels by 505. There you go, my heart is almost square. And yeah, just make sure true color plus alpha is selected before you click export. If I load this in Photoshop, let's see what happens. So I opened Photoshop here. I loaded a picture from the internet, no problem. And I want to see if my exported graphic will work on top of this picture to see through it and, you know, kind of use it as a sticker or something. So I'm going to go to file, open and open my the heart from the hard drive. Here we go. This is the picture. And you already see that in Photoshop, you have this uh, sort of a checkered background here to indicate uh, transparent background. So what I'm going to do is actually uh, select all control A and copy this and move to my picture here and control V to paste. There you go. My heart uh, illustration here is on top of the picture. If I, if I scale this and then you can see that you can see through it um, my graphic here. So if I zoom in, there you have it. So this is how you export a transparent graphic from Zara Designer Pro X using the PNG export. You need to make sure it's PNG format. That is a, a format that's lossless and also supports transparency or the alpha channel 
as it is called. So I hope this was a useful tutorial. It was very quick, very fast, nothing fancy here. And um, if you enjoy my tutorials, feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel, like and share this video, and see you next time for more Zara tutorials, graphic editing, video editing, all that stuff. Thanks for watching.